vault. So before doing round vault, I recommend you to do backward snake, be comfortable with backward snake, and then you could attempt to do ground vault. So I'll just do it now along these four columns, and then I will break down what I'm doing and give you some tips. Okay, so that's ground vault. You can do it over one cone, over two cones, over three cones. If you're doing it over three cones, your leg that is not vaulting would want to be a bit further back to allow you to vault out further, okay? If you're just doing it over one, you don't need to have such a gap, all right? So basically the first part of the trick is relatively easy and people find it quite easy. So it's just around the cone like that. This leg goes around the inside of your skate, face the stair, where the camera is. And the other skate is up on one wheel. You're up on your toe with the other skate, okay? Like that. Now comes the hard part where you want to turn around. Now, in order to turn around, you want to get your shoulder and this part of your body around as quick as possible, okay? That's one of the tips I would give you. To get around quickly and then lean forward and fall into it, okay? It will take practice to get it smooth, to get it right, but Keep at it if you can get it. Around, okay? Around. The whole time, the right leg is staying on the toe. So I'm vaulting with my left, the inside part is facing out. And you can do around one, around two, around three. You can change it a bit, you can work with it, you can mix it in with stuff. So it's a really, really, really good trick to have. Because there is a moment when you actually can't see where you're going. So here is okay. On this moment, you can't see. So you want to get around as quick as you can. And it will become natural and, and it's, it's a trick that feels really good. It's nice to do. 